We're going to try to turn these into these. So Bill got a wild hair and decided to get $500 in half dollars. So we're going to open it up and see what we got. Oh, haven't opened it yet. So uh, we're hoping to get a variety of the uh, half dollars and not just the newer ones. Don't try this at home, kids. Ooh. Ready? Oh, okay. Surprise. All right, you know what? This, this is gonna be good. They're all different. We got new ones that are Seemingly, you know, the 2020s, and then we've got ones that are the uh, centennial ones. So, and we've got some older ones too. It's gonna be good. Yep, I'm excited. So this is it. We are gonna get this box um, gone through, and hopefully we find some cool stuff. So we're gonna take some of these out. Do you want me to wear gloves? If you want to. Look at that. Mm. We're not eating a meal. Did you just um, Yeah, so. Look at these here. Um, you can grab some. Top one here is a 74. Sure. There's a couple here that I wanted to delve into a little early. This one here, look how shiny that one is. It's a real shiny coin. So what we're looking for, obviously, when we open these up, ideally it'd be nice to find a silver in here. Then we'll all check all the coins for errors. There's not a ton of errors on the halves, so silver's our primary, what we're looking for. You only need one roll right now. Yeah. What are you taking the rolls for? These are mine. <laughs> These are mine. Open something. Oh. So basically, um, and you're gonna wanna open it out here in front of you. Want me to just crack it like that? No. <laughs> the, open it in front I'm of I'm just kidding. Mm -hmm. But he's watching us from afar. I already ordered new coin rolls so we can roll the ones back up we don't want. So you kind of look at the edge first. What is this, Willy Wonka on the Chocolate Factory? Remember the way Charlie goes and opens the wrapper? Yeah, slowly. And he's like all excited and then he sees the corner and okay. he's like, oh. So the edges here, you, some of them are beat up, you can see, but uh, I don't see any silver in this one. They're all a little beat up. What is wrong with mine? Oh gosh, don't look at the way I did it. Well, this is your first time. I know how to open. Well, I don't open. Man, I worked they're... in customer service, okay? So I, you don't open rolls of quarters and stuff like that. Wow. 1972. Man, some of these things are really beat up. Look at that. They're not beat up, they're just tired. I can relate to these half dollars. Baby. I'm not beat up, I'm just tired. Mm. If we find a silver out of a thousand coins, I'll actually be pretty lucky. 1974. Gosh, they really are a mix, aren't they? Yeah, they are. Some of these have had a bad day, though. Ah! Okay, hold on. Oh, there's a centennial one. Ooh, say that. I like those. There's a couple of them. Bicentennials are kind of cool. Here's another roll that's pretty tore up. Man, these things have seen some better days. They're almost like the ones that the silver dollars used to get at the casino that went through all the slot machines and just pounded. I mean, look at these things. Oh, look at I did it. That one is totally chewed up. That's a bicentennial too. Maybe but he was hungry. We're primarily gonna looking for um, the best coins we could maybe salvage something, but I have a funny feeling these are gonna be really bad. I'm gonna have an optimistic attitude. Oh, it's good for you. Cause I know I'm getting ice cream after this. Yes, you are. Oh, look at me, I'm so special. You're so special, what'd you find? Oh no, cause I opened it well. That's all. Nice, yeah. This one's pretty shiny looking. 
Oh, this is 2021 derp. There's nothing in there as far as silver, but there's a shiny one right, uh, right here. That's really pretty. 22, that's the newest one. Wow. That mark on top though. Ooh, here's another one. 23, that's a really nice coin. I'll take a look at that closer. I think it's 50 cents if I'm Don't mistaken. Don't finger it, I touched on the oh, side. Oh, I'm sorry. If we find really nice ones, we don't really want to oh, let oil sorry, all over it. I didn't it. know, I didn't know. Do you want me to wipe it on my shirt? No, you ruin the coin if you wipe it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you never want to wipe it. I coin. don't know. Okay. You get a handle. So what we look for, is there any chips? Like if a coin- He's got a little nick on him right there near his neck. Yeah, see what happens when they, they make the coins. If you ever watched a video on how they make the coins, they all come shooting out of this. I've uh, never watched that. Anyway, they land on each other and they scratch each other up, which kind of, unless they're a proof coin, of I course. don't ever watch on how things are made unless oh, it's food. Oh, I love that show. Unless it's unless food. Unless it's food, of course. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Get these out. I want to make so many jokes right now, but you know what? I'm not going to because that's mean. What do you want to say? I'd rather not say. They're like, oh, you know, I think I... <laughs> Oh, look at look at the camera and tell what you're thinking. <laughs> is it clean? Uh, it is clean. Then it's say clean, it. It's clean. It's clean. It's clean. I was going to say, uh, oh, wait, where did I put that coin? You want me to separate them? Sorry. The nice bad. one, yeah. Okay, my bad. Uh, I was going to say, I think, I think I see a little hole in his head, right? That's just wrong. <laughs> you should have kept that one to yourself. <laughs> I premised you. You said it was clean. That's not clean. That is clean. That's not that's not my definition of clean. Oh. Yeah. That clean was something else. There's other ways to be unclean than that. <laughs> God, I can't believe you said that. Christine at digginsocal.com. <laughs> hey, you know what? For the people that don't know, because nice we one. also have young viewers. No. Uh, don't even go. There. Just drop it. My bad. So um. Are people going to be mad if we start going around spending 50 cent pieces? <laughs> Why would they be mad? You're putting them into... And they're all tore up anyways. Clearly they've they moved around. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. And wow. These things got... You know, it's almost like they were together and got beat up. They almost match. Look at these two right here. They're, they've both got the same damage. Ooh. Ooh, that one's kind of interesting. 73, we're getting closer. Oh, I'm gonna defeat you. Here's a 22 that is in nice shape. Do you have another thing of felt so we can put the specials over there? I'll go and put those on there. That's fine, just, uh, yeah, we'll put them. Because I'm not responsible for... Most of these are just, they've been handled so much, I'm not worried about gloves. It's just the really clean ones may have... Yeah, uh, I'll, keep it, I'll keep it clean. The nice thing about the real clean ones, if you find one that's a high grade, it actually has some value. Then I get the hard work. I bought that uh, 2024 coin book. I finally got one. My last Whoa. one I bought was a... Wow. What happened to that guy? I'm making sure it wasn't silver because uh, sometimes silver does that, but it's not. Um, so now I, I, I had a red book in uh, 2015 was the last time I bought one. And I was going through some of my old coins um, by number only because I have them written down in the old book. And uh, wow, I have, a 1800, I have an 1800s quarter that was about $160 value. And it's now it's like 320 it's like, Wow. Coins can be a good investment, that's for sure. Well, what is this on the end? You know what we look like? Whoa, that's a weird one. It's only a 71 though. But yeah, it's got some dark. Interesting. That one's the shiny. You want to take the shiny? Yeah, I'll take the shiny. From the you can touch the edges. Just... I don't want to touch the edges. It's fine. Just... Oh, I want to see what year it is. Is it over? Oh, it's a 2018. I like the older shiny ones. It's not really old. Compared to the other ones. Wow. And then Christine gets to roll all the coins. You're good at it. Oh my God. That's what we're going with? I'm yeah. good at it. That's why I have to do it. I was looking at those coin roll machines online. Just curiosity. Not that I really want one because I got Christina roll coins. They're like $300 to $400 for a good one. And oh, the, I was going to say. I've had cheaper ones and they don't really. And they're they, horrible. They're supposed to put the coins back in a roll for you and it doesn't work. It doesn't get past the fold at the beginning. And it makes a big old mess and not a good idea. 
a waste of Gosh, money. I, I think that if you wouldn't have done metal detecting the way you do when, when you retired, I think you would be that person that would go and put negative reviews on everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. I think I think you would be that Yelper, you know. Is got any good stories? Ah, uh, good stories. Um, Your pepper spray may work. Stop. <laughs> no, I didn't pepper spray anyone. You want to do a pepper spray challenge? You can do it. I've already been pepper sprayed. So have I. Okay, but your pepper spray that you got is different from the one that I got. Oh, so you say. It's true. They changed the recipe. Oh, horrible looking coins. Look at that. Probably say the same thing about that. Um, have you ever seen such a horrible looking set of coins? Yeah, I I, I don't want to. No? I don't want to get sprayed again. I didn't like it. Oh my gosh, it's the coins. I was like, what is that noise? <laughs> uh, yeah, I did not like it. How about taser? I wouldn't mind getting tased. I feel like that wouldn't be as bad as getting pepper sprayed. It's quick and over. Yeah. We have a little way of doing it where we used to attach the um, little alligator clips instead of being shot with the darts to get an experience of what it felt like. And it doesn't feel great, that's for sure. Ooh. Again, I've never been tased, but I would rather get tased and pepper sprayed. The toy one is all scratched up. It's not worth saving. And I don't care what people say. Nothing helps, okay? People will be putting milk on their eyes. No, nothing helps, okay? Yeah, I found a That's few, an urban legend. A few nice ones we got to go through a little closer. An old wives tale, as it were. Yep. It's a lie. I think people think that it makes them feel better, but it doesn't. Who's writing on JFK, bro? Wow. Who does this? Wow, another set of Torp coins. Who abused these coins? Look at this. Well, think about all the pennies and the dimes and how jacked up they look. No, yeah, these weren't in the ground. How do you know? I don't, but... Mm -hmm. Do I have any interesting stories? Usually you do. Usually you usually can't shut up. Oh, wow. In a nice way, I mean. <laughs> I don't mean that negative. I really don't. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have said that. Uh, one. I knew what you meant. Um, it's funny. I, I remember coming back from work and talking about my day. Yeah, it's really about three minutes worth of talking. And I'm done. And... Her stories about work, she talks about her day. <laughs> it's almost minute by minute. It's like... And I have the worst memory about things, but too. You tell, you, but you tell the story so well. Wow, this one's got a hole in the side. Oh, my gosh. Dude, how does that happen? What a strange thing. 74. Yeah, look at this. There's a lot of 70s coins in here. Like 70, 71, 72. They were good years. 73, 74. Why I said ten. Shiny, Ooh. Ooh. Two right here. I like shiny. There's a couple. There's a couple shiny. What are there? I don't know. I can't think of anything that happened today. It was. It was not. Now the day before was just. Oh my gosh! The day before felt like pandemonium. That was ridiculous. There's just too much, too much going on. I was all over the place. I was sweaty and sad. I didn't even get to eat lunch. Didn't you give your lunch away? Uh, I gave my first lunch away. Oh, yeah, because you worked two shifts. Yeah, I worked a double, yeah. Yeah. I made chicken pot pie. Homemade. Yeah. Except for the crust. Yeah, I don't know how to make the crust. If anybody has any good pie crust recipes, Christine at digginsocal.com. I like to cook. Right, Bill? Yes. I cook like every day. Right, Bill? Ah, oh, scratched up. Yes, every day. All day. Not all day. I have to sleep. Yeah, this is. That's what I was expecting. Why do expecting. you do cool stuff with these coins? Yeah, like what? Yeah, I have no idea. I know nothing. Spend them. 
Ooh, you know what we could do? We could get a glue gun. People will not like this. It's okay, though. Get a glue gun. And then, like, glue it so it's like this. Like this. Hold this. Why? Hold this. No. Please? For the demonstration. No, uh... Yeah, okay. Hold like that. Move your finger out of the way. And then do that. And then we could do... Like this. Your hand's in the way so you can't really see. Stacked! No, we're not gluing coins together. Easy to say when it's not her money. Oh, all of a sudden. <laughs> okay. Oops. Oh, I'm going to remember this for sure. Oh, easy to say when it's not her money. It's nice bicentennial. It's digging SoCal money. Yes, it is. Mad money. Just kidding. It's digging SoCal money. Anyway, we are 50% done with the box and have not found silver, so my anticipation is dwindling. Oh my gosh, what what's going on with you, man? He's got papers everywhere. My pile is nice and neat with the exception. They're for Buddy. Here, no, Buddy. No, 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 no. He's asleep. Oh. All right, we'll take an intermission. We're halfway done. We have half to go. So um, let's bang through this real quick. Let's see if we can't find something. I'm taking a break. Really? There's, no, I can't see. I don't have glasses on. Whew. Getting old is not fun. Yeah, some of us don't wear glasses. You wear glasses. I know, I do. I can see far, I can't see close up. I can see close up, I can't see far. Ooh, especially at night, ooh. Yeah. Come on, give it to me. Go, quarters, go. Ooh, my bad. Go, half dollars, go. Eh. What's the word, hummingbird? There's one at the, the end ones are always fairly nice. And then there's one in here that looks like it might be kind of nice. Other than that, it's just more lovelies. So once we get them all sorted out and checked for silver, I'm gonna go through them, not on film, because that's probably gonna be really tedious and boring, and look for anything that the book says could be errors, or, you know, something like a double die. That'd be nice. Double die? Double die. They died twice. You were die? Yeah. You should not say that. <laughs> Nothing good in that one. Not true. Well, got a bunch of pieces, it's right? money, exactly. So we should go out somewhere and eat and then pay in 50 cent pieces. Ooh, you know what I saw? I saw a video of, um, you know, Dick's, Dick's Last Resort. Okay. It's a restaurant, uh, it's a sit down restaurant. They have them in all sorts of, you know, I think across the country. One of the places is in Vegas. <clears throat> it's, uh, this woman shows up, and this guy literally just roasts her. Just makes fun of her the whole time. She wears the little, the little paper hats that they give you. And at the end of the video, after she's eaten her food and dessert and all the yummies, yeah, she pays in rolled pennies and quarters and dimes. Some of them are just loose pennies. She just dumps them out. It was funny. I'm glad you thought that story was entertaining. Yeah, we went to that place once, didn't we? I know, but we never paid any pennies. Yeah. You ever wonder the story of a coin, where it's been, how many hands it's been through, and maybe that's why our hands are real dirty when we uh, handle them. You should have washed them first. The coins? Yeah, clean mine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? Or would that be considered laundering money? Because you're cleaning it. See what I did there? Yes. Oh, wow, that's sad. Did you go back under our bills, though? That was a tip. Oh. For doing the video. Now I'm paying you? Yeah. That just in a cupcake sound. Monetary guy. Ooh, no, there's a shiny one. Pretty. Shiny. A couple of shinies in here. Ooh, we should tell them what we did last week. What did we do? 
from one of my days off that I had, which was really nice, by the way. Um, we did a puzzle. We did two different puzzles. One of them. Well, we did one and three quarters. Stop. Why would you jump to the end? You're a horrible storyteller. <laughs> I tell the story. All right. Let me just. Yeah, but it's a journey. I'm just going to open quarters. Whoa, what happened to these? You probably heard your storytelling. Oh my God, I can't believe You know what? Forget it. I'm going to tell this story anyways. How dare you? Let's just put that in a file. All right, I'm going to tell a story. You can do these. Try to be a little more excited about the coins. I am. Woo, look at these. I Wee. Okay, so we did one of the puzzles. It was a cute little countryside type of cartoon, and people were in little horse-drawn carriages, and um, then we were, some of them are horse-drawn, weren't they? But then some of them yeah. are um, like regular old, like Model A, Model T. Yeah. Anyways, so we're putting the puzzle pieces together. We did the edge, and it's funny because Bill and I have never done um a puzzle together and i guess he's very like type a about it he was like okay well how do you do a puzzle and i'm like i mean i usually start with the edges oh okay yeah yeah i start with the edges and i'm like sometimes i get a little distracted but we did the edges right nothing new finished the puzzle we did it within two days because i had to go to work took about well like did we see like six to eight hours on that yeah then the next one was a uh, uh, Norman Rockwell, and it was uh, um, Saturday Evening Post. I think that's right. I think you're correct. Okay, good. And it was the uh, it's the one where the the chef is sitting in the kitchen. There's all these like pastries and cakes, and he's uh, he's eating a really sad mean like I was gonna say mangy. Meager? <laughs> That's not the right word. Like small, depressing looking salad. Just carrots and like lettuce. No tomatoes, no like other stuff that you'd normally put on a, a salad. And he's sitting there and he's eating it and he's holding a, he's got a fork with some food on the fork in one hand and a book in the other. And it says, how to eat healthy. <laughs> Now, the difference between the brands of the puzzles that I bought from the Cartoon Cottage versus the Saturday Evening Post was night and day. The pieces were very abstract. In the process of trying to just get the edge pieces done, we ended up giving up because we couldn't find the last piece. And it would just have taken days. Well, yeah, we... <laughs> Do we get everything done with his um, white send, outfit? Send the Donner party. Are you jumping again to the story? Sorry. <laughs> <I'm>, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're going to have to send the Donner party out for that last piece. So we kind of like, we're like, you know, let's just sideline that one. We're not going to do it right now. We'll just work on other pieces that we can identify and, and match. And the cakes kind of, and then it was a watercolor. Yeah. It was a watercolor, so everything was very washed out. And the chef is wearing the normal little smock that they wear with the buttons across. And he's wearing a white hat. And his pants are white. Everything that this guy is wearing is white. Yeah, that was it, not fun. And so, um, what else was, and then it had dark edges. Oh my gosh, if you guys check it out, it was a really hard puzzle. Horrible. <laughs> this is Bill's nightmare is going through coins. That are I like, love coins. <laughs> Lawn lowered coins. <laughs> I honestly thought we'd get something. This is probably a roll or roll somebody else already went through and then re-rolled. Stop. You're so negative. <laughs> so um I know I oh and then the way that the we had set up the puzzle, we weren't like sitting next to each other, you know, cheek to cheek working on this puzzle. 
I'm sitting on the opposite side. So Bill is looking at the picture right side up, and I am looking at the picture right side down. I don't know how you did that. I was it, was, it was upside down for me. And um, Bill's just putting pieces together, and they're just, oh, my gosh. It was all, oh, my man. You can say that I'm better at puzzles than you. It's okay. Oh, my gosh. Whatever. So, um... He's putting pieces together. I'm like, man, I'm really having a hard time. And then he was hoarding the lid to the box for a bit. So I'm just trying to figure out what I'm even putting together. Don't look at me like that. And, uh, well, that guy had a bad day. But wow. show them. Show them. Show them the side. And then, like. <laughs> it almost looked like silver for just a split second. So, well, you didn't notice that there's a picture in there, too, though. Yeah, but it was all folded up. It didn't lay flat. And we have the pieces laid out everywhere. It took up the entire six foot table. So I can't just lay like a, yeah, no, that did not work. You were hoarding the lid. Um. Everybody knows you're supposed to use the lid. <laughs> one time, that's like the one time guys will actually use a lid for a puzzle. <laughs> See what I did there? Yeah, it's coming. <laughs> yeah, I got it. <laughs> you just got it now. I'm a little slow. <laughs> <laughs> this is what they're looking like every time we pull uh, a section out. This is how excited Bill is every time he pulls those out. <laughs> so we were doing so good. It was, I don't know how many days, because again, I was, it was during my work week. I don't, did we do it on my day off or did we do it during a work week? It was your day off. We spent a long time on it. Yeah, so we were we spent hours and then Bill would walk away and then he'd come back and You have to take a mental break. You have to give your eyes a rest. Yeah, I mean can you imagine having to look at that thing upside down? I don't know how you did it. It was okay. <laughs> but it's funny, I'd walk out for five minutes, come back in, then all of a sudden I'd put like six or seven pieces in right away. I know. He it was like he you know what I think I know what happened is when I would go and like walk off somewhere and come back, I think what he would do is a number of the pieces. And then he'd wait for me to sit back down and be like, oh, you know what? I think I need to get up and take a walk. And I'd be like, all right, yeah, for sure. And then he'd come back, boom, boom, boom. You numbered those pieces, didn't you? No, but these had some nicer coins in this roll. Good. Not silver, though. Grumpy Gus over here is getting a little bit of a grin. Um, <laughs> let's see here. Yeah, ultimately, as we're putting the puzzle pieces together, we did so good. We got all of it done. All the outside, the edge, we found that lost piece of the edge. It was like some weird looking piece. Did not even, I, I think I found it. I was surprised. I did because you were outside in the garage. And I was like, I found it, I found it. Is that where you're yelling? I can hear you. Yeah. And you're like, Oops. yeah, whatever. So then, oh, that was shiny. He's shiny right there. Yeah. Look at that one. I'll check it. Um, Sorry, I get distracted. We had filled in all the pieces. All that was left was the chef's uniform. Every piece is white. It's all the same shade of white. They're all sh shaped weird. They're all cut weird, these pieces. Nothing fits with nothing. Bill's not a quitter, neither am I. Normally, I, I can't believe I quit that. You didn't quit, you took a break. Well, we put it back in the box. Like, I've never quit jobs. I've only taken breaks from them. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. The good thing is I put it back in the box really carefully, so it's in sections. It's in cheat mode. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, yes, for sure. But I like building stuff, though. One of, my, one of my friends has those. I want to call them adult Legos. They're the Legos that are motorized they got moving parts and stuff and it, the, there's a book on the directions and how to put the item together it could be a big old dump truck or I something saw like one that of a cherry blossom oh they're little frogs look at that one what about this one right here that one right there right what about there it? it's right junk. there you're junk the 72. look at what i did i see that i'm so talented you are i quit your day job i can't it's actually a night job, but I get what you're saying. Yeah, you know what I mean. Do I? Oh! What are you doing? Nothing, I'm playing. You could open some. I could. Oh, why didn't I do this? I'm so mad at myself. I don't know why I didn't do this earlier. I'm glad you didn't. Why? They're heavy. 
I dent up the coins are kind of already dented. Yeah, they are. This one's got a bad day here. Ooh, okay, we're doing it. Hold on. Wow, these are all chewed up. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, hold on. Hold on. Oh yeah. I did it. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Wait. Whoa. Look at that one. I did it. I did it. Look at it. You're I did so it. talented. Thank you. I'm gonna give you a bonus. You know. Stack. The funny thing about a lot of these, they actually look silver-ish. Like a handle on it. It's like. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh. Yeah, see that? <laughs> and that's why we don't play at the table. <laughs> Are you having fun? <laughs> I'd get good openings though. Me too. I say that in a struggle. Dang, these things are horrible. Wow. Look at this guy here. What year is that? That's how I feel after my death. That's a 97. Bro, he's seen a lot. Wow. Here's a Torp Bicentennial. Wow. Well, we're getting down to the wire. We're not finding any silvers. Well, you know, if I work to the bank, can, can you go through it yourself when you're rolling them? And say, oh, I'm going to buy this. Because one of the bankers was telling me that she collects um, the coin or the dollar bills that have the red this seals and blue seals. This is actually not bad yeah. for me. Yeah. yeah. Go over there. Um, so apparently she works at the bank when they come in with that kind of money deposit. I guess she cashes it out and keeps it, which I don't think. I didn't know they could do that. but I, well, I feel like that's an integrity check if you ask me. But uh, I had a friend that worked at a grocery store for like 45 years, and when she retired... 45 years? Oh, yeah. Did she just start when she was 15? Yeah, and she retired Shut like 60-something. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. She had um, boxes and boxes of silver coins. She's, she was smart enough to collect them over all the years. And uh, she I don't know how many she ended up having, but there were a lot. She goes, you want to go through these with me? I go, no. Oh my god. I'd still be doing it. And this was years ago. Dude, that would have been awesome. Yeah. Wasted opportunity. What a goober. Huh. What a beat down coin. Wait a minute. Yeah, I just almost thought it was something else for a second there. Speaking of goobers. You know, it'd be funny as a find a Franklin in here. To you, that's, um, that would be silver because it's older. I gotta sneeze. Don't do it. Don't do it. Ah. Ah. Oof, that was close. That was a close one. Well, thank you for not sneezing. Yeah, because then you'd edit in a fart after I sneeze. I know you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'd make it normal for Be you. Be like, hey, you. <laughs> no, don't even get me started. She always blames Buddy. Oh my gosh, there was one time I was doing a check. This is at work. I was so our checks. We're walking around making sure everybody's good. And uh, <laughs> there's this lady. She was asleep, dude. And uh, she had had some problems, you know, emotionally and stuff. And uh, she was knocked out. She had been like noisy the whole night, like having a rough time. She was having a bad day, as I like to call it. So afterwards, she's asleep. I walk past, she's snoring so loud like a like a bear, just sawing wood. She rips the loudest fart. <laughs> Echoes. <laughs> wow. I would imagine since you work nights in the jails that there's a lot of gas type noises and snoring. Um <laughs> and then <laughs> and then I'm not talking about the inmates. No. Here you go. Go ahead. Go ahead. I want you to... I'm just looking. Well, show the camera. I'm going to... Look at what a good job I did. I did a great job. You're 89. <sighs> I already see chips on it. So. Oh! Put him back. You're going to hurt his feelings. Embarrassing him in front of all of his friends. Well, this is one of the worst coins that was in there. Look at this. Would you agree? He's definitely having it. Oh my gosh, look at the edge. I know. Oh my gosh. Wow. 
Well, we struck out on silver. No, we didn't. Well, mm. silver, yeah. But we didn't strike yeah. out on coins. No, we have... There's some nice ones. Um, we'll definitely... Um, I'll get out and I'll look at them all for quality and see if I can't find anything that's mm -hmm. close to MS60-ish or better. Mm -hmm. See if it's worth saving. Even a coin that's MS63, a half dollar, I think it's only average about $3 value. Yeah. So, eh. Yep. But that all was right. fun. Well, I'll well, see you later. Where are you going? Sit down. I'll go ahead and roll those coins. Where are you going? You can roll the coins. We're not done. Sit. Oh, my bad. You weren't excused from the table, young lady. There's no food here. <laughs> Anyway, um, that was still kind of fun. We did something different. There's a lot of yuck on the fingers, but um, I'm kind of glad I didn't wear white gloves. They would have been black. They would have been great. There's some nice ones, though. Yeah, look at this one. I have to get a hold of that. I see all the mint marks, though, from going through the machine. Dude, I like this. I'd put this on a chain. You should. With the St. Michael on there? Why not? Yeah. We'll flip coins to see who has to do the wrapping of these. I already know who's... You're going to pick a double-sided coin, okay? Yeah. You're going to get a coin that's got heads on both sides. It's a cheater coin. Yeah, of course. And you'll be like, heads! Yeah. Heads I win, tails you lose. Is it? Did you hear that? Yeah, buddy just jumped off the oh window. Oh my gosh, I was like, this guy, what is he getting into? Hey, what are you doing? I saw that cat out there again. Oh, okay. We have a stray cat hanging around. Oh, it's not going to be stray for long. No, it's straight. But he's getting a little brother. No. No. I'm not pregnant. But he's going to get a little, uh, little That'd brother. That'd be funny. That would not be funny. That would be scary. I don't really notice anybody coming over here and taking you on a date, so I don't know how that's <laughs> even possible. <laughs> you know why? Because I have a cat. Yeah. Apparently that's a red flag by itself. I didn't even know. You, I heard you got accused of being a cat person. I am. Look, buddy. Hi, buddy. Oh, my gosh. He's so cute. He's ignoring. Anyway, that's a wrap. Oh, look at his ear. <laughs> what? Pick him up. Oh, my gosh. Come here. Come here right now. Go grab him. He's on your side. Grab him. Grab him. Grab him. Hi, buddy. Grab him. Grab him. Oh. Like wild beast. Don't hit the green screen. Oh, my gosh. Do you like 50 you, cent pieces? You missed the whole thing. What do you think? What were you doing over there? Hmm? Hmm? The fun part, get to roll these all back up. All right, just to wrap this up, in the beginning of the video- In the wrap-up? In the wrap-up. I said that we were gonna hopefully turn a box of rolled coins into any type of profit. It would have taken just one cool thing. And we Money failed. Bags. And we failed. Oh. But it was fun. Might as well just, I wish we had a balloon right now so I could just let let it fly, you know, let the air out. Uh, <laughs> Bill's hopes and dreams. <laughs> but it was definitely an experience. I enjoyed it. Um, I went back through the coins and wow, I separated. Um, there's really only one coin I found online that mentioned an error and the 74D had a double die and it was um, more prominent under trust. Didn't find any. Um, however, I'm keeping 10 of the best coins I found. Um, they'd be kind of cool to have, I like them. And I'm keeping a handful of Bicentennials because I think those are kind of cool too. So I'm basically keeping a, a handful of coins. And then of course, Christine found her two favorite coins. Oh my gosh, he found one. So one, there's, there's this little bad boy right here. Bing! Which I like. And then we've got this other guy. Oh, this one's actually perfect. I know. I'll see you wear that. Oh, man, that's awesome. Yeah. So she's got two coals with... Coals. So she's got two holes with coins in them. <laughs> Wait, no. Two coins with... <laughs> Cut. <laughs> Strike that. You have two coins with holes in them. Did I do it right, finally? <laughs> you have two holes with coins in them. <laughs> I guess that's just down here as a blooper. A little tongue tied. Yeah.
They sound nice. So it's almost remember when I was a, a young lad in uh, Reno playing the actual slot machines. I won. Anyway, are you done? Don't don't cry. These are my coins. Oh my god. But um, none of the really nice coins would even be worth grading. There's a lot of um, mint marks for me to be in mint bags or when they come off the machine. <sighs> but we're done. <laughs> Chuckles here. You know why that's funny? <laughs> like, do you know how many people, when they get arrested, they, they like, uh, they keep things, hold on a sec. They keep things in what I call a personal pocket. So even when they have to change out of their clothes, into uh, their arrestee clothes. Sometimes mm -hmm. they keep things in a pocket that is not a, a clothing pocket. That was funny. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I cried. Yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching. We do appreciate it. Um, we may or may not try this again in the future, but it won't be 50 cent pieces. If you've had luck with other denominations of coins, let us know. I'd like to try it again. Just to clarify, these are the coins with the holes, okay? Just to clarify. All right? <laughs> they are nowhere at, there are um, there are no coins anywhere else than the the coins with the holes. This isn't going to end, so I guess I set myself up for oh that one. Oh my gosh. You apparently you set me up for that one. I was the butt of the joke. Well, next time you're doing the wrap up by yourself. <laughs> All right, goodbye. The more I think about it, the funnier it is. <laughs> That's mm. worse than my Kennedy joke. You're awful. <laughs> Which I'll probably edit out. <sighs> All right. Oh my gosh, I'm so sweaty now. You're wrong. Christine's got two more little coins in her. It's not that funny. It is. It is. Uh, That's why I'm sitting like this. <laughs> I missed that one. Where do you think I said you had holes? In your head? <laughs> no, I would never. Oh, we're done. <laughs> this is a G-rated show. I know. <laughs> These are the holes. Yeah, she's you not said, you. You said Christine has two holes with the in them. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, I get it. <laughs> Why did you think I was laughing so hard? No, I just said it backwards. <laughs> oh. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Yeah. Ay, ay, ay.